Hey, Jordan VR here with another tutorial. I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix the annoying issue when you're in full body. So basically, if your controller were to die or turn off or your trackers, automatically Steam VR likes to swap your tracker. So basically, if you were to plug everything back in, turn it all on, your tracker, so for example, your foot tracker would swap with your hand and your hand would swap with your foot. It could also swap with your waist. And I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix that issue. And it's actually really easy. Um, so let me switch over to my Steam VR view. Okay. So basically, all you have to do is you click this little gear icon here, the little settings button on the right of the Steam VR dashboard. Uh, you want to make sure you're in controllers here. You go to manage Vive trackers. Now, these are going to be all of your Vive trackers. Now you might have some that show red if you had other trackers connected at one point, but whatever ones that are green, you're going to want to change them to the tracker roll. You're going to want to change it to left foot. The next one, you're going to want to change it to right foot. And then the third one, you're going to want to change it to waist. Now it doesn't matter which you put in order, at least from my testing. So um, after you do that, and actually I'll put it back to held in hand just to show you guys. Now I'll turn off, uh, I'll turn off one controller. Let's see. If I were to turn it on, most of the time it'll swap. Yeah, you can see how my hand swapped with my foot. So I'm going to turn my controller. Well, actually, I'll go ahead and go back in the Steam dashboard. So you want to click the dashboard button on your controller or your button on your headset. If you have a Vive or Index, click Manage Vive Trackers, change it to left foot, right foot, and again, Waste. Now I'm going to turn off my controllers. Actually, I might need to turn off the foot too. Let me see how it works here. Nope, there it goes. So that's literally all you have to do to get it to not swap. And I know a lot of people, they restart their Steam VR and this and that, but all you have to do, just go to Manage Vibe Trackers and do exactly what I showed you and you should be good. Um, I think that pretty much wraps it up for this tutorial, I mean, it's really simple. <laughs> it should be like that default with Steam VR, but I don't know. Maybe they'll update it later. But I hope that helped a lot of you guys that use full body tracking. And uh, see you guys in the next one.